Hey guys, um, I'm at the park and I'm taking my knees out for a test drive. So my right knee has bothered me for several months to the point where I went to the doctor in Panama and it's just been just paining me. Um, I think it's osteo, to be honest with you. This is the same side where I've broken a leg. I've been in, involved in many motorcycle accidents and car accidents, um, some of which resulted in surgery and hospitalization. So I'm happy to be a walking, breathing person, but this knee has been problematic, but it's been particularly acute since November. And I think just from overdoing it, climbing volcanoes and, and temples and all of that with my travel. So my goal today is just to take a five or 10 minute run to see how it goes. It was a little bit better in February and I went out for a run and I read way too far and aggravated it and it's been hurting every day since. So now it's feeling better and I'm just going to see how it goes. Um, in terms of the diet, I've been still keeping real clean. Um, basically the diet again is rice, sweet potatoes, um, let's see, vegetables, excluding night nightshades, which are things like tomato, uh, potatoes, and peppers, and fruit, excluding citrus. So I've allowed myself to eat maybe like some crackers when I want something, some rice crackers when I want something crunchy, but I discovered rice crackers have potato starch. I didn't look at the ingredients, so that goes out. And um, I ate a piece of fish last night, but not bad for day 13. Those are my transgressions. Not so bad, and I'll be clean from here on out. So I'm making it till day 30, and I'll let you know how my run goes. Hi guys. Well, I got about three minutes into my run, and my right knee, the offender that I've been talking about this whole time, I felt a little tinge of something, so I just stopped. My left knee now starts hurting. So I give that credit for two things. A, I've been doing a little self-massage, which Brett from Vitality Massage Channel taught me when I went to help him pack a couple of weeks ago. So I'm going to provide a link for anyone else who may be having some issues. He has excellent videos on self-massage, and I found that they're pretty good. Um, so I did that on my right leg, and I didn't do it on my left. So I'm going to go home and do that. And I'm a big girl, so maybe I need to start out power walking. I also find that when I run in Vibrams, I don't have as much knee pain. I mean, let me take these off. Go figure. doesn't make sense to me, but all I know is what I know. And this course is so muddy out here. It's been raining like crazy in Georgia. So let me show you what I've been running through. Well, actually walking now. And here's my shoes. Are they ruined? I think not. But I think they're going to have to go in a bag before they get in my dirty car. My car is not that dirty. Um, so let me just give you some feedback on the last few days. I know I gave you some a few minutes ago. But my one of the big things that's happened to me is my fatigue is out of control. I mean, it was really bad. And I think I was just detoxing because I feel really jazzed and excited and energetic right now. So I think I was just going through a detox phase. And, but it was quite something. So if you're doing an elimination diet or a juice fasting, that's pretty normal. And don't get freaked out. I think I'll probably still haven't done an enema because I'm not in my own space with my own stuff and privacy. So maybe I'll go get a colonic or do an enema in the next couple of days. But hey, I'm feeling good today. And I'm sweating, getting those toxins out of the skin. So until next time, I wish you much love.